I've been playing squash since I was uh, nine years old. I actually uh, started playing because of my dad. Uh, I was playing with his friends actually, and uh, I jumped on court with him and uh, started like, like I started holding a squash racket and at that time I fell in love with the game. And since then uh, I decided that's the sport I want to play. But I think the first time I decided that I want to be, become a professional squash player was um, at the age of 17 when I won my first uh, World uh, Junior Champion. And I thought uh, I want to make this uh, a career and uh, pursue my dream of becoming world number one one day. That's exactly uh, what I think uh, Lincoln Co. And it's about innovating and exploring. And that's uh, technically how I see my journey in squash. Uh, it's always about uh, looking to become the best version of myself and always exploring and uh, uh, trying to improve as a, as a squash player but most importantly as a, as a human being as well. Many people know me as a squash player, but they don't know that I study engineering, construction engineering. When uh, I finished high school, I had several opportunities to go to the US and uh, study there, but I want to stay in Egypt and uh, play squash because squash is the best country. But at the same time, I didn't want to compromise my uh, academics or my uh, studying career. and. Uh, that's when I decided, okay, I want to also uh, pursue my other dream of becoming a construction engineer. And uh, that's something, uh, I think that's one of the main things about Lincoln Co. is the limit is your sky and uh, just uh, you don't put any like barriers or limits to uh, what you can explore and achieve. And uh, everyone out there was like, it's so hard to be like a professional squash player and study engineering at the same time. But I just uh, decided to challenge that. And uh, I think Lincoln Co. it's the same, uh, they have the same concept about challenging and always uh, improving and uh, finding new solutions uh, about the problems. So uh, that's why uh, I'm very happy to work with such a company. It's, it's a very good question because in general, individual sport athletes, they're always used to uh, do everything by themselves and uh, they always think about themselves more than, uh, than the team event sports. But we also, people don't know that we also have team events that are being played. Like last year we just won with Team Egypt, like the third uh, World Open title. Uh, we won it three times in a row actually and uh, the team spirit is so important that just one person is not able to, to make the whole process happen. And I think uh, Lincoln Co. really focuses on the, the teamwork and uh, having like gathering the ideas and working together and having this team spirit is so important as well. As an athlete, you always want to achieve a lot during your career. But the biggest message or the, the main thing about all of these achievements, I think, is to inspire. And uh, it's actually something that makes me very emotional sometimes that I will find someone, one of the younger kids, especially girls, coming to me and they're like, we actually love the way you really inspire us to become a better squash player. And uh, I think that's the whole point of, the, of what we're doing. That's how I, I grew up. I, I've seen big champions in Egypt like uh, Ranim and uh, Omneya and having this and uh, have this inspiration I think is so important uh, and it makes it easier and uh, to believe and to, to dream about it. Obviously, I think the social contribution and the culture promotion is, uh, is something that is very common uh, for me with uh, the Lincoln Co. Uh, uh, perspectives or values. Like the social contribution that you try to inspire the younger generations to become a better version of themselves and uh, uh, become uh, big champions and uh, uh, representing their country uh, on big stages is something that we're very proud of. The part of the culture promotion, having a lot of, not only in squash, I mean in in other sports as well, having a lot of female athletes competing and uh, actually bringing Olympic medals and world medal, world games medals or world championship medals and uh, 
uh, making their country proud uh, and uh, it's something that I'm very proud of and something that encouraged the younger girls and the younger uh, generation to come up with the idea that they're able to uh, break all the boundaries and, uh, and compete on the world stage.